guys i go back to my channel hope you guys are doing well so today's video is something different you guys know that i like to spread the gospel on here i put some more like christian content so for today's topic is about being lukewarm so stay tuned if you want to know some tea about being lukewarm like you don't know when you're being lukewarm because you have more and I ain't gonna be like rude when I say this, but you have what's up? How y'all? Hold on. You have more like really friends than Christian friends, and you do more really things than you usually do. But at the same time, you still try to go to church, and build a relationship with God. But but then you know you still hang around them friends, yeah, partying, drinking, smoking, having sex, doing all that type of stuff. You know, doing everything under the sun that you're not supposed to do. So it's just like you got one foot one foot in, one foot out. So you. At the end of the day, you got to choose, you know, where you want to be. So, you're going to be in it or you're not. So, yeah, like, just being lukewarm, you're just doing, like, worldly behavior things. And deep down, you know you don't want to. But you probably do, and it's just pleasures that you like. It's just you're comfortable. And you're like, okay, well, I'm comfortable here. You know, I have more friends and stuff. I'm not going to be lonely. Yeah, being lonely is scary sometimes. But at the same time, it's a good thing, though. And the guy is going to see you, friends and groups that you can't hang with. But it's just right now, since you shouldn't, you start fresh, you know, stuff is not looking good. But a re I think a, a lot of people, they be in a lukewarm season because they are comfortable where they at. And, you know, they don't want to try anything new right now. they just comfortable, like I said. They just don't want to give it up. So, and that's another thing, like being lukewarm. Like, you just, sometimes you just got to give it up. Like, you can't. You gotta let black people go. You gotta let the stuff go. Partying, drinking, smoking, whatever you, you doing, having sex like it's a commitment. And a lot of people they like, well, you know, if I be lukewarm, I'll be okay. No, you gotta make a choice if you wanna be have a relationship with God, actually grow in Christ, or be lukewarm and go to hell. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm being real with y'all, and nobody gonna tell y'all nothing else. I'm being honest with y'all, like being lukewarm is not gonna save you just because you going to church. You just being a good person. Dang, for that save you to hell. You can still go to hell. So whoever told you to be a good person, you go to um, go to heaven. That's a lie. You have to receive Christ in your heart. If you have not received Christ in your heart, I know what to tell you. If God comes to that, you will be going to hell. That's what I'm saying. Like y'all gotta get your life right. Being lukewarm is scary. Like it's not a joke. Like that's why I quit doing it because. Like, I was just some more really music and stuff. I ain't really, I went to parties a little bit, not really. I was more to myself. But mine's definitely listen to, like, the wrong music. And I let it influence me. So that's why I'm like, I don't listen to no more really music for real. But it was more like, you know, just negative stuff. Like, they were saying the same thing, sex, drugs, drinking, and all that. I was tired of hearing that. And I was like, Lord, I'm really going to change. Like, I'm not going to listen to none of that no more. I'm just going to just... I don't want to do that. That was not the last thought I want. So, I changed it. So, I got a scripture for you guys. Being lukewarm. Mm -hmm. I got my phone. I hate when people park by me, y'all. Like, that hurts me. Like, you see all these other parking spots. At first, I went to Target, and then this girl parked by me. I'm like, I'm not parked all the way in the back, y'all. I'm like, it's so irritating. So I'm going to read from Revelations 3, 15 to 16. It says, I know all things you do that you either hot nor cold. I wish that you were one of the other. Now, God said this. But since you are like lukewarm water, neither hot nor cold, I will spit you out my mouth. Anyway, God will spit you out his mouth, basically. God, he don't want you to be no hot or cold. He said, pick one. You have to pick one. And the guy don't like, you know, there's one water. So he want to switch you out. He just going to... God just don't like that. So, you just really just have to choose, like, what you want to be, which one you want to be in. Like, really, you got to talk to yourself. Really sit down and talk to yourself. What side do you want to be on? Write stuff down. What do you want to change? Like, because we're really coming to the end of this earth. Like, God is really coming back. And people playing games. So... Get your life right with God. You know, it's not too late to change. It's not it's not too late to change your relationship at all. Never too late. 
but just know that God is coming and you don't want to miss your mark or you going to heaven like no I hate to see any of my friends go to hell for real like that's what I'm telling y'all like y'all need to get y'all life right before it's too late because you never know what's going to happen tonight. You don't know what's going to happen within 30 minutes. You don't know what's going to happen next hour. People just die left or right. You just never know what's going to happen. You can even be driving something happen. Like, you just never know. Like, it just be stuff that's unexpected. And that's why I'm like, you got to stay prayed up. You got to make sure you have a relationship with God. Because this stuff ain't a joke. So. That's all happy you guys for today. I know this is a very, very short video, but I want to talk about this because it just been on my heart to talk about it. I've been putting it on hold for a while, but I'm like, I need to talk about this because I used to be lukewarm and I just, I just don't like it. But yeah, I used to just, I used to change my music for people. Oh, I was blurry. Like when you people come in my car, I'll be changing music. They're like, oh, we want to listen to this. I'm like, okay, yeah, you can do it. No, now when you get in my car, you'll see whatever I want to listen to. Like you ain't, mm -mm. It be ranchy songs too. I'm just like, yeah. And then it's just, I did so much stuff wrong and I wish I never did. But it's okay. It's okay if we make mistakes. We live, we live or we learn. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on because I'm going to start dropping some videos. So, school is going to be out in the next week or so. So, stay tuned for that. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.